Let me tell you a story. Many people think I came to Heritage Academy to run from my motherly sisters. <laughs> to find a personal identity in myself away from being just the triplets. In part, they're right, but for the wrong reasons. Let me tell you. I realized I wasn't happy, that I needed God. I'd always enjoyed playing video games. I would sink them out whenever possible, whenever I had any free time. I found a happiness there, a life that I could create for myself. I played for many, many long hours, often skipping social activities and meals. I didn't find happiness, so I played more. I tried to quit many times, but either my resolve would slip away before I could make a decision, or perhaps I would make that decision. But within a day, no, nah, I'd gone right back to it. For a long time, I had to convince myself that it wasn't even bad. Otherwise, I couldn't live with it. I had to convince myself that it wasn't bad. So I did. It had a deep control over my life. And I played more than I did anything else. Eventually, through God's mercy, God broke me. I like to say this because I felt my life was not only a landfill, but one I realized I couldn't clean up. I was bullheadedly doing my own thing, picking up a piece of garbage here while dropping a dozen more. I liken my actions to that of a Bronco, bucking at all God asked of me. Eventually, I looked up and around me and realized that this landfill was about to swallow me up. And I had to make at least one last effort or choose forever to stay there. But it wasn't my effort. I prayed to God to save me in the past, to give me strength over this addiction, this control. But I never really gave my all. Okay, God, I'll give you this, but let me keep this. So that's where I was at. Yes! Or no. Not at all. Never. Make a final decision. Enough of this tormenting. On a car drive, December 18, 2014, I said yes. Like a broken horse who was tired of fighting the rider, depressed of what he was fighting for, and quite frankly, for a depressing cause, I let God change me. I let God be God and change me. I deliberately chose and fought to be here at Heritage because I felt God was calling me, wanting me to have a new life here, a new start, a place that encouraged me to go freely in my relationship with him and with others. And that's exactly what Heritage is. It is simply a positive environment where if you let God change you, he will. My charge to the students of Heritage Academy and the junior class of 2017 is to let God change you. I served a video game God. He was on the throne of my life. Do you truly want God to change you, or you let the landfill swallow you up? Who is on the throne of your life? <laughs>